Welcome to the DevOps course. This course is a specialized course, unlike a lot of courses out there. We'll be doing a lot of hands-on exercise and we'll concentrate on the DevOps toolchain. DevOps is a new philosophy that can help software organizations innovate faster and be more responsive to their business needs. It promotes collaboration between developers and operations and overall improves the quality of software development and the product. I'm very excited to let you know that there are very few courses that will cover the DevOps toolchain in as much detail as you see in my course. And I'm very excited to present this course to my students. Over the course, we'll go through all the different tool chains and we'll cover in depth the installation and configuration and a bit of code through all of the section. At the end of the course, you will have knowledge about GitHub, how to use GitHub. You will be aware of the branching strategy that we'll be using. You'll be aware of how to do the commits, how to do the merging, and you will be aware of how to create releases. You will be also be familiar with setting up Jenkins, the different kind of jobs that you can set up using Jenkins that will help facilitate pushing code to Artifactory and to GitHub and deploy to Tomcat. You'll also be getting hands-on experience in setting up Artifactory and be able to distinguish between snapshot and releases within the artifact repository. And you'll be able to run a sample Spring Boot application where we'll do the setup, a basic amount of testing on the server side, and a simple change on the UI to add the bootstrap. And you'll be setting up three instances of Tomcat that will mimic a environment that's similar to in an organization. We'll also be setting up Kibana, part of the Elk stack, and look at the data that's aggregated through Kibana, Elasticsearch, and Logstash in a single dashboard where you can visualize the state of your application and your servers. In addition to learning through all of this, you'll be able to look at the artifact repositories. You'll be learning about SDS and some of the gotchas within SDS. You'll be able to use the terminal or git bash depending on which computer you have. You'll be able to use another lightweight editor for basic text-based tasks. And you'll be able to use Atlassian source tree to use the Git flow workflow that was developed by Vincent. So this is a complete hands-on course that will make you ready for the DevOps environment within your organization or be it be a change agent that you want to become within your organization. So I am excited that you have chosen this course over many other courses. I'm sure that you'll learn quite a bit in terms of all the toolchain that we have seen through in this video.